Hey guys, I'm Brittany Hughes, you're watching MRC TV, and this is our reality check. Earlier this month, three United States soldiers were shot to death in Afghanistan by an Afghani operative in an attack that the Taliban claimed credit for. It was reported at the time, but of course this story did not get nearly the fanfare reserved for Twitter feuds between Donald Trump and the left-wing media. But it should. Their names were Sergeant Eric Houck, Sergeant William Bays, and Corporal Dylan Baldridge. They died on foreign soil, were mentioned in passing in a few stories blasted out over social media before slipping quietly into the darkness. But we should know their names. These three servicemen are not the only ones whose lives have been lost in the line of duty, even recently. Seven sailors who died two weeks ago aboard the USS Fitzgerald will not be celebrating the 4th of July with their fellow servicemen, their families, or their friends. They won't get to enjoy the fireworks, the hot dogs, or the parades. Their loved ones will celebrate this holiday and every single one after without them. These stories are repeated again and again throughout our history, stretching back nearly 250 years. Stories of men who looked across the sea at the most powerful king in the world and said enough. Stories of men who stormed beaches and crawled through trenches, of those who went down fighting and others who died keeping the watch. Stories of soldiers and sailors and airmen who stared tyranny in the face again and again and sent it straight to hell. Many of them are no longer here to celebrate Independence Day, but it still exists because of them. So this 4th of July, whether you're raving against the president's tweets or a reporter's bias, whether you're still upset over last year's election or mad because the media won't shut up about it, let's all just take a moment, even a brief one, to remember we have the right to complain in the first place and to celebrate those who fight for that right every day. And that's our Reality Check America. Subscribe to our YouTube page, follow us on Facebook and Twitter, and happy 4th of July.